Hey everybody, Mike Dukes here. I'm with Eddie. We're at the Kokomo Humane Society. And tell me, what is your favorite chip? Oh, it's got to be Cheetos. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Cheetos. Why is that? That's this guy's name. And I don't know if you can see it right now. He has some very unique eyes. What do we know about Cheeto? Uh, Cheeto is, um, she's a little sweetheart. She's about six years old. Um, she's already fixed. Just so loving. She's been purring the entire time I've been holding her. Um, when people go to clean her cage, she follows them around and rubs on their arms and things like that. She's just, just a real sweetheart. Just, <laughs> and she's got really cool eyes. We're going to have to get a, a close up on those. Oh yeah. Um, don't know what caused it and, but it doesn't seem to give her any problems. And just really unique. She's so sweet. She's just so friendly and just wants to love on somebody. Any idea how old she is? Uh, we think around six. A little bit older, but still plenty of life left in her. And what would her adoption fee be? Uh, her adoption fee is only $30. That includes um, her vaccinations, microchipping. Um, a lot of the local vets are involved in a free wellness exam now. Um, you get so much for so little. <laughs> yeah, so see, you could either A, go to the store and buy a bag of chips, which would be mostly air, or come here, get this Cheeto, and get a whole package full of good stuff. And when you pet her, it doesn't turn your hand orange, you know. You can smile, no orange teeth. Yeah. There are many benefits to this Cheeto. And let's see, coming up this weekend, you guys are going to be at, oh yeah? <laughs> Petco, yes? Yes, uh, Saturday and Sunday we will be there. So come see us both days. You don't only have to take an animal home one day, though. You don't have to take one both days, but you can come visit both days. But you might want to take an animal home both days. I'd be okay with that. Cheeto here might like a little buddy. You never know. And I also understand you have a program you're about to enact here really soon, if you haven't already. Yes, uh, we are going to be starting a barn cat program, um, which is actually kind of, it's in this, the starting phases, and that gives um, the cats that are a little more on the wild side, um, not this one here, she definitely wants a person to hang out with, um, but, you know, a cat that doesn't want to be around people, but it still wants to be useful, it's going to go into your, your barn or your outbuilding or your warehouse <laughs> and um, take care of your vermin problem. And all you're doing is you're providing them a safe, warm place to live and maybe a little bit of extra food. And, <laughs> and then they, they keep you rodent free. Uh, their adoption fees are going to only be $10. So come in, get signed up, call in, ask for Eddie. I'll put you on a list and get you ready for a barn cat when, you're, when you want one. See? So if you live out on a farm, out in the country, maybe you got a rodent infestation problem, you're thinking, man, how am I going to get rid of these? Barn cat, or barn cats, plural. Mm -hmm. Yep, they work good in teams. And sometimes uh, sometimes you get one that might not be too friendly, but might come up and visit you every once in a while. We'll, we'll let you pick. If you, wanna, if you want one that's going to come visit, but is a little rough and likes the outside life, then we'll find one of those for you. But if you want one that's going to keep their distance, we can find one of those for you too. So. Got a so lot of cats fun. here. <laughs> A lot of cats, kittens, we got dogs, we've got it all here. You need to come in here and check everybody out. There's some people who are ready to go find a forever home. Like Cheeto. Those eyes, I love those eyes. So if you're in the market for a barn cat or cats, Kokomo Humane Society is the place to come. Call, ask for Eddie, he'll set you up. Don't forget this weekend, maybe a little rainy, you're thinking, man, I should stay home. Or... Go to Petco, check out all the uh, fine folks that are going to be there. And as always, come to the Kokomo Humane Society. It is the place, if you're going to get an animal, you want to get it here. We'll see you next week.